as we inaugurate the 150th anniversary of our dear Trinity College in Kandy, I bring greetings from the Diocese of Kurunagal and the Church of Ceylon in Sri Lanka. This academic institution was started by the CMS missionaries 150 years ago as an integral part of the mission of the Church of Ceylon in Sri Lanka. They have served the nation for 150 years. As we begin to celebrate this great event, I think it is necessary to reflect on the name of this college, Trinity. What does it mean? This is a Christian doctrine. Triune God, God the Father, the ultimate reality, God the Son, the manifestation of that reality and God the Holy Spirit, the sustainer of this ultimate reality. As we reflect on this great mystery, the Trinity, I think it is important for us to comprehend the necessity to protect our environment as well. In a way, we can compare God the Trinity with our environment. God the Father is like the air we breathe, oxygen, and God the Son the manifestation of that ultimate reality can be compared to the food that we eat for our enrichment. And God the Holy Spirit is the spirit of truth, can be compared with the water that we drink to sustain our lives. Therefore, as we begin to celebrate uh, this landmark, let's commit ourselves to protect our environment, our common home, to live as human beings and also as animals, we need three necessities. Air to breathe, food to eat, and water to sustain our lives. All these three necessities are supplied by the trees. For trees to grow, we need to protect our common home, our environment. Therefore, it is my request that as we celebrate this festival, let us dedicate ourselves to preserve our common home so that we'll be able to make our environment safer for us and for the generations to come. We have realized this responsibility as we go through this value of death called COVID. May the triune God bless, preserve, and protect you. May God bless you.